my daughter and I just came up here on a weekday, Mount Baldy, uh, Ice House Canyon. Not too many people on the trail today. It's hot. We stopped at this nice shaded area here. Look at this. We just came up here. Have a couple ice cold peaches. And looking for some rattlesnakes. Only brought the flash. No stove or anything. Just that water. I'll show you guys around a little bit. These peaches are juicy, aren't they? Spilling all over. They're good though, huh? See me. See me trout? There might be some. They go underneath those rocks and you approach the pool. It's a small uh, natural. Right in this area, where that little spring comes up from the northwest across the trail, makes it become muddy. You get down here where the railroad ties are. Um, the stream has actually cut down to the bedrock. No more dirt there. It's straight down to the bedrock. There's, a, there's an awesome little pool. Let's see. Try to find it, try to locate it. Pool there, it's usually a really big pool, a small pool. Hardly any snow and rain this year. Now that being to the bedrock, right up river here, there's a place they used to gold mine. Down below, there's a place they used to gold mine. They never had much success gold mining the canyon. They did, however, used to hydraulic uh, wash the, uh, the notch hydraulic mining up a notch and I guess they were okay there but it was contaminating the water source for everyone around with the clay and such so they made them stop and all the old mining sheds were torn down you can still find pieces of the wood laying around up there let's see it'd be northwest of where the, the present day notch restaurant lie if you head northwest, um, just above to where the road is, go back a little bit on the dirt road, and then down below you in the south, in the ridge, there's pieces of the old cabin laying all over right there. But we're only going to go up a little bit forth, further here. I haven't seen any snakes all day. We're going to go a little further here, and I'll show you one more of the areas they used to mine where they uh, used to dynamite in the side of the hill. I've even found remnants of an old mining cart underneath some of the rocks. It's still there. If it's still there, I'll show it to you. Although the guy that owns that cabin across the road was aware of it. So he might have pulled it into his own shed there. But where they used to mine, it's right back here. those rocks are. I believe the mine used to be just north of this telephone pole is what a guy was telling me. He said it was visible up until the 70s, 72 I think he said and then uh, just rock slides have just totally covered it and uh, forestry has done their best to seal it. 
so people don't get trapped in there. There's a garter snake right here, a big, beautiful one. I don't know where he went. He couldn't have gotten far. They're fast, but not that fast. He was too big. I hear him. He's gone. He's, he's in there. I heard him. They are fast. Maybe I'll get lucky and see another one. How much cut? Lizard. What kind? A blue belly. Very young one. Okay, you now put him in your hand. Okay, put him. rub his belly slowly, slowly and easily. Slowly, slowly, easy. Don't push down too hard. Okay, stop. Take your hand off. He's out cold. Look at that. Move your hand. Move your other hand. I'm going to zoom in on his eye. Whoa. Focus. Focus. Sleep. Sleep. But he's still breathing. Look at his stomach. Okay, now turn him over. But he's going to take off running, so. There he is. Snapped out of it. It's weird how it puts them to sleep. <laughs> Just relaxes them. Anyway, we'll release him. This is the Chapman Trail. This is, we are at the Ice House Canyon, Cucamonga Wilderness, eight tenths of a mile. Well, I only saw one snake. It was incredibly fast. This is about the last little turnout before the trailhead. It's awesome, but those are fast. The chances of me catching them are very slim to none. I'm gonna give it a shot. Yeah. Awesome. Check that out. Genie! Scored! He bit me. But he's not poisoned. Look at that. Look at him. He's awesome. He just ate. That's why I got him. The lump in him right there. He probably looks like the size of a trout or a mouse or something. Whoa! 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 Look at that. 3D, baby. Mm, 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 mm. I knew I'd probably find one down here. The, like I say, the, the trout are pulled up in little pockets. These are nice Yellow ones. stripes. These are the kind they sell in pet stores. Put him back. Genie like cutting him. At least tying himself in the knots. I'm put him back right where I got him from. Watch how fast yeah. these things are. Right. Don't drop him, Genie. You want to release him? Put him back over here. Put him back right there in that rock, right there in the shade. And there he goes. He's gone. Under the tunnel. I seen him right here. 
see if we can find another one. The trailhead's right down there, almost back. Well, unless we see something on the way down the mountain, that's the end of this trip. Not bad for a little lunch hike. <laughs>